YouTuber James Charles responds to harassment claims. We'll explain the drama and tell you how Tana Mojo is involved. I'm Kelsey Banis and you're watching The Daily Report. As we all know, YouTuber slash makeup guru James Charles had a blast at Coachella, hanging out with friends and showing off his chaps. But when some fans started to notice a mystery man in several photos with James, they had some questions. Like, is James in a new relationship? After a fan thread caught James's eye, speculating about a budding romance, James responded in a now deleted tweet. Quote, nope, unfortunately, I am still very single. This boy played me for months on end and is a disgusting con artist. I'm thankful I had my friends to protect me. Fans were quick to find out that the mystery man in question is a model from New York named Gage and flooded his Instagram defending a sister. Gage clapped back at fans saying, quote, some of y'all are good, others just like tea. It'll be cleared up, no missed details, no con artist accusations, period. And that's when Gage made his first ever YouTube video to tell his side of the story. In the video called What Really Went Down Between Me and James Charles, Gage started from the beginning saying first contact happened in January of this year after James DM'd him. The two chatted for a while and Gage claims James would continually put pressure on him about starting a relationship, despite Gage telling him he was straight. Fast forward to Coachella, and according to Gage, James had invited him a couple of times, both instances which Gage had refused. But a couple of days before, Gage contacted James and told him he wanted to go. He went on to say he felt pressure from James all weekend to experiment, and when turned down, James would play his emotions to try to guilt him into it. This was contested when leaked text messages between Gage and James were posted on Twitter, where James said Gage told him he went to Coachella to quote, make things right in person and test out how it would feel to be in a relationship. James went on to say in the text, the two had kissed, held hands, and cuddled. All things Gage did not refute within the text. Now, controversial YouTuber Tana Mojo is getting involved and being the protective best friend we all know she is. Last week, she DM'd Gage, stating how sad it was to see him attempt to ruin someone's reputation. And from an outside perspective, he is displaying sociopathic tendencies. Gage then tweeted the conversation, saying he and James are in contact and handling it like mature adults. Tana then replied she watched him kiss James and lead him on all weekend to then make a YouTube video accusing him of being a sexual predator. To which Gage responded she shouldn't be getting involved as he and James are ending it right now. James quickly jumped into his conversation tweeting, ending it right now would mean that you were actually responding. Let's not play more games. This is getting intense. And now James is giving his side of the story. Are you staying with me? Because this is a lot. This weekend, James tweeted a long note with the simple caption, boys. In the note, James confirms the timeline Gage had given, but where Gage says he called and simply said he wanted to go to Coachella after refusing twice, James claims Gage called him and said he wanted to go and explore his sexuality. After the aforementioned kissing, hand-holding, and cuddling, James said he would check in with Gage to see how he was feeling. And that's when Gage told him he liked where things were going, but he still wasn't sure about his sexuality. Once Gage confessed he didn't have feelings for him, James said he couldn't help but feel used. He went on to say, quote, I would never, have never, and will never pressure a guy to do anything. Everything that happened between him and I was 100% consensual. He goes on to take responsibility for the fact it was handled poorly and shouldn't have been made public. But it was his fault for tweeting and he wishes Gage no negativity at all. But now James is moving on and we wanna know what you think. Are you satisfied with James's explanation? Let us know in the comments below. And as always, don't forget to subscribe to our new Awesomeness TV Daily Report channel, where we are gradually moving all of our daily reports. So make sure to subscribe over there and check us out. Thanks so much for watching. I'm Kelsey Venus, and whew, this is intense.